Alright guys, what's going on? It's me, Christian here, and today I have yet another story for you guys. This one is not, like, crazy, you know, some of my stories are honestly crazy, and then some of you may know, like, vets on the channel and everything, uh, know that some of my stories are really just that you know stories they're not crazy they're not like these insane events sometimes they're just stories and that's this one today's event we're gonna be talking about is the time me and three other friends uh, traveled to California to go to this like music festival last summer when I say the three of us so there was one kid who was 18 there was one kid who was 17 and I was 16 at the time and there's another kid who was 17 so one senior two juniors and I was a sophomore at the time I had been friends with these guys and I, like I said I never say names um, but you know I had been friends with these guys for about at least like four years and we all knew each other so well we had all saved up our money we talked about this months before and we're like all right we're gonna do this we're gonna go we had money for the tickets we all pitched in for gas money and we all had money for the hotel room after going to the hotel we went later that night at about 7 p.m. when the concert started and uh, this was the first night so the first night was kind of just like an opening thing and there was like a couple bands and then the second day was like an all-day event with just tons of bands so this was um, just the short oh, intro I guess you could say something like that we had a lot of fun that night it was good and we got back to the hotel and everything went really smoothly we had dinner that night in fact we had in and out twice that day because <clears throat> uh, we had it for dinner as well and so we went back to the hotel kind of chilled we didn't get a lot of sleep I'd say we probably got about like four hours of sleep that night because we all kind of just talked and I had actually brought my Xbox and so we played a lot of Xbox while we were out there and stuff the next day we had to wake up at about like 11 and uh, traffic is just nuts in California like we did not anticipate how crazy traffic would be like that was just seriously insane but we finally got into uh, the concert center which it was like this big uh, outside sort of arena type thing with a stage and the middle like the main stage and then there was a second stage off to the side where they were, they like I would say the non the not as big acts we're playing right we were mainly at the main stage one guy wanted to go see another band I don't even remember the name on the second stage and 21 pilots ended up playing that second night which was the big one that was pretty much the reason I was there like I love 21 pilots about halfway through the day we lost our seats right so we went out to go eat because this was like a general admission concert and we went to go get some food we went to get some drinks and everything and it was good you know we felt good and we came back to the seats and we were like, seriously, our seats are gone. And so we had to move onto the grass and actually sit on the grass. Right in front of us, these guys were smoking pot. And I swear, the smell of pot was just disgusting. And we had to deal with that the rest of the concert. Just these guys blazing it up in front of us. All this smoke going into our face. This just putrid smell. Like, I don't know what it is, but pot just smells disgusting. Especially when it's right in front of you. And we all reeked of pot that night. You know, we checked our clothes and everything. And we smelled like pot because they were literally that close. And the way the wind was blowing, that smoke was all coming right on us. Later that night, 21 Pilots was the uh, the main act. And we that was a really fun Fun show like it was an upbeat show they're crazy dudes like they do flips and stuff and I don't know they were just off the hook 21 pilots absolutely amazing if you haven't heard them go check them out dude um, they were great later that night we went out to in and out again because I mean that we didn't even want to eat anywhere else like in and out was so good and then when I ended up getting my burger I had a giant piece of hair in it and I was just like all right you know that's cool uh, but I ended up eating it and then that night we went to the hotel and let me just say this hotel was like off the hook and yeah so we got uh fresh hot baked cookies every single time we were in there they just had this container full of fresh baked hot cookies that anyone could take like they were free uh, as long as you were staying at the hotel of course and yeah I probably had about like 30 cookies in that two day span um, because every time we just come back to the hotel like he would just have more cookies and then I'd eat all of them and he would have more and in that night I was like dude can I take like just a bunch of cookies to the room he's like yeah that's fine no one will probably eat them and these cookies were the bomb dude they were so good so we got back to that to the hotel that night and everyone wanted to take a shower at night because we were all gonna leave in the morning and we didn't want to like jack up the bathroom and like not have time before we go and so that night one of my good friends was taking a shower 
um, the 18 year old guy. Uh, let's just say his name's John. I'm not going to say his name a lot, but yeah, John was taking a shower. It was really steamy in the bathroom and I started to get a stomach ache, right? Like I get random stomach aches and to the point where I just have to shit, dude. Like if I don't shit, it's just going to come out, you know, it's just going to explode on out of there. And so I was at that point where I'm like, dude, I have no choice. I need to drop a duke while he was in the shower and I just remember sweating my balls off because the shower was so made the room so humid and hot and everything and that was just crazy but I went there and then I flushed the toilet because someone had used it before me uh, one of them took a crap before me I went to sit down and I take pretty long craps and so I'm there for like 20 minutes and he's like seriously you need to get out of there I need to get out of the shower I'm not getting naked in front of you and I'm like dude I cannot help it it's just coming and coming about five minutes later I feel something on my butt and I'm like whoa what is that in the water level has risen up to my butt and I'm like oh my god you're kidding me and I'm not even done yet so I'm doing the penguin walk back to my bed with just the toilet paper and I'm like going ham I have the trash can and they're looking the other way because they're freaked out and then the kid that's in the shower can't get out of the shower because the bathroom is flooded so we had to call the guys and he got his towel we brought him his clothes and everything he kind of just skipped over the water and got back to uh, his bed but yeah they ended up cleaning it up and we had to stay up later than we even anticipated we probably shouldn't have even gotten it clean we should have just been like all right you know what? we're just gonna go tell him about it in the morning uh, because it made us like end up getting about like four hours three hours of sleep it was totally stupid because we had to leave so early and uh, yeah but anyway that was that crazy trip uh, the way home we had no problems everything was smooth sailing just listening to music and everything it was a really fun trip and uh, this video was longer than I anticipated but I hope you guys enjoyed I will talk to you later for another video tomorrow thank you so much for watching and peace guys